My name is Eric, um, Eric Tay, and then I'm from uh, Liepin, and I'm the CEO of Liepin North America. Uh, also, I'm graduated from Penn and Wharton. I joined Liepin last year, uh, joined June, and um, running the company for almost one year. And we're just waiting for the PowerPoint to come up. Um, a brief overview of our company. We're one of the largest human resources platform back in China right now. If you're a Chinese, you're probably familiar with Liepin. Um, if you think of it, it is a LinkedIn version back in China. And back in China, we have over 200 and uh, we have over 500,000 clients. So basically, all the China for, uh, Fortune 500 companies are uh, our clients. And then also, we have over 40 million users. Yeah, so our company is established in 2011, and then now it's our six and a half years old. But right, um, uh, but we started our U.S. quarter now in 2016. But we restructured the entire company last year. So um, in last year uh, June, when I joined, now our uh, U.S. team have overseas team have over 20 mem uh, 20 employees. And then um, if you ask about uh, our comparative advantage to a lot of our competitors, then we are one of the only company back in China who already exited the uh, phase where we use word-to-word -word matching um, for, for jobs, recruiting, and all the search. Instead, we walked into an AI data mat matching series. So for all the clients who found employees on our platform, maybe um, Minsheng, Zhao Hang, Oppo, Ali, all these large uh, corporates, um, maybe they hired over tens, dozens, um, hundreds, and thousands of employees on our platform. We know who they want to recruit. So for example, they have a, a tendency for people coming out of Baidu, a uh, tendency of people who graduated from Wharton, from Harvard, from all these places. So from these matching system, AI system, we recommend the right people to them. And then for consumers, for candidates, we recommend the right companies uh, for them as well. And then, um, as I said, we have over 40 million users, and then we're actually going IPO this year in Hong Kong. Um, and then um, we have over three, 300,000 headhunters on our platform as well. So we're the, one of the only company that we link the business side, client sides, um, uh, business sides, candidate sides, and headhunters together. So we're one of the B2C to H um, three-sided ecosystem. And then also, um, um, if you look at our platform, um, what we do the best is we provide a lot of o, o plus O services. So not only online, but offline recruiting candidates to search for um, screenings and then for, um, for, for, for different timeline matching. Um, uh, I'll just skip this slide. And then um, you can just uh, see us as Uber within, uh, uh, Uber within the taxi industry, uh, uh, hiring industry. Um, and then um, we're all technology driven. So uh, we have all the AI headhunting. We have all offline recruiting, students recruiting, um, campus on campus recruiting, and then as well as what we call ourselves um, the, one of the, the largest headhunting platforms with 40,000 headhunters active on our platform per day. So we are also a lot of co-hosts with a lot of largest student organized events back in the States, um, including um, China Harvard Forum, Penn Ward China Forum, um, US USC forums, all of that. And I don't think we have a lot of time going through our services, so I'll just go, uh, go through very quickly. Um, this is our website, and then where the platform you use all of the companies' HRs to um, search and lock in of the candidate, uh, candidates we want. We have job posting, web resume research, resume management, chat, chat system, um, recommendations, internal refer, all of these. And then we also, um, th these are online products with invitation of can uh, candidates fast entry, uh, intended communication. It's all very mature um, in, in, in ba back in China. So we're bringing what we have in China to the States. In the 40 million users, we have 160,000 users in the States. So these are just some photos of the events we're hosting. Um, and then um, we also have a lot of marketing with, uh, uh, with online talks, chats with different companies, and then um, also uh, company listers, uh, postings to, um, for all of the Chinese companies in the States with cooperation with um, all the top 50 universities and top 100 uh, schools c c career center. Yeah. And then that's pretty much it. Thank you. And then we're, one of our aims is like, uh, we're aiming to separate the uh, Liepin North America, this entire corporate within two, year, two to three years time. So even though our main company, uh, the entire Liepin is going IPO this year back in Hong Kong, but what we see in the future is to separate 
uh, Lip North American and maybe get listed um, potentially in the future separately. Thank you. So, so thank you very much. It's very interesting. It looks like that you've already got all the money in the world. So why are you here today? Uh, what are you looking for specifically? Specifically, we're looking for more of our clients, customers, business, business back in the States because our business model in the North America is more focused on helping overseas students, in, po in particular Chinese overseas students, to find jobs and return back in China. But also, we're, we're developing and then um, expanding our network back in the States. So we're ha ha trying to help local companies who is interested in Chinese international students to find jobs in the current places. So we're here, one, to attract more of the Silicon Valley, some of the companies or corporates who are interested in our company to become one of our clients in the States, as well as potentially current local funding for next year's next rounding. Because um, even though we're a um, subsidiary company of the entire Liapin, but we have complete self-autonomy. So we're looking for potentially B round funding next year. We, for our A round funding, we got 1.5 mil. But for the next round funding, we're looking for a uh, much larger in expansion outside of maybe the U.S. market, but the entire overseas market. So let me see if I understand this. Hopefully somebody else has the same question. But it sounds like you're starting a new business in North America, and you're raising capital beyond the A round of financing to grow that business. Am I on the right track? Um, yes. So actually, uh, to clarify, so because you guys go uh, pre-IPO right now in Hong Kong, and uh, you representing the Liaping North America, this might be a separate business, a separate entity in North America. That's what you coming for to raise the money in addition to promote your brands. Yes, so we're a subsidiary company with full autonomy. So when, when we go IPO in Hong Kong, we uh, are entire listed. We're, we're controlled by Liapin. So we go together with, with, with the Hong Kong IPO, but we're looking in future that um, when the business of entire overseas business outside of mainland is growing much larger, then we have the ability to go listed ourselves in the North America. So yeah. right now is a, a wholly owned subsidiary of the parent company in, China, in Hong yes. Kong? Yes, in, in China, yes. In, in China? Yeah. Okay, so you're looking for the investor in North America specifically for the division for the subsidiary in the States? Yes. Okay, and you are going through the IA round or B? Oh, uh, we're, we're um, for the next round will be B round, but we just finished our uh, A round last year. Okay, A round was fully invested by the parent company um, or outside the investor? Um, parent company and outside investors. Okay, got you. Thank you.